Hello guys, it's me, Saifa. This is like my third or fourth video. I'm sorry I keep looking at the monster because I'm not used to it. But uh, I did this look today, this eye makeup look. If you guys want to see how I did it, then you can just keep watching. I hope you guys subscribe, please do. Please uh, like the video if you do enjoy it. And also ring the bell so you're notified of any future videos that I make. Okay, thank you. Favorite palette of 2019. Beautiful. I have a monitor right here, so I am going to be looking at it so much. I am sorry, I apologize in advance. It's new, everything is new. So I don't have a primer on, but I do have some concealer and a powder. So I'm not going to put a primer on top of the powder, we're just going to get started. We're going to be using this first color here called Peen. It's a yellow color. Okay, I'm going to be putting this yellow color right above my crease and blending it inwards. These kind of looks are my favorite. I've done something similar, but... I'm gonna try and make it different, okay, of course. But I've done something like, you know, yellow and red. I just feel like red today, so we're going for it. It's like all these red, yellow colors. I really have to do more of uh, neutral looks, which I do on a day-to-day -day basis when I go out. I'm actually just wearing neutrals. But when I'm filming, I just feel like playing with color. I don't find neutrals boring for filming. I'm bringing it very high up because at the end of the video. in English. Hopefully, I can make it this time. So my language, of course, is Swahili. My mother tongue, I'm from Tanzania, so and I do have a lot of Swahili followers, especially on my Instagram. Even here on YouTube, I don't have that many followers, but you know, for my people of Instagram, they watch this I want them to understand, so I'm going to be speaking both English and Swahili. Just like that. Musha tutorial nataka yellow yue na unikana bado. Okay? I'm looking at the monitor, so excuse me. Sorry, I have to. I will be adding the orange color from this palette. It's called Lit. Now this, I'm gonna put it directly on my crease. Hap and done. Nayeka mojo kamoja hap and done. Done your crease. Come on, Ivo. Just like that. I always drop it. I'm putting it downwards, but the more I blend, the more I napanda you. Nsianze, you put color on top. But if you put it on top, the more you blend, it keeps going higher. You don't want it to go all the way to your eyebrows. So I am putting it like right in this crease here. And don't worry, if I blend it, the more I blend it, the more it gets higher and higher. So you see, I put it directly on my crease, but the more I blend it in a flush upwards and up in a not so much pigment, some other pigment that you get right here in your crease. You want to make life easier for yourself and make, have less patches? Way, eka kala hapa too on your crease and let it go upwards when you blend. I'm adding. Okay, I told you I'm going to be adding the red color called Inferno. Now this one, I'm going to be popping it right again in my crease. I just placed the, placed the product there 
when we use the same brush that I use the orange shade, I'm just going to get a bit of orange and then I'm going to blend to this. Taking the same brush from the yellow, I'm just going to be adding a little bit of the yellow and then further blending it. Now that that's blended, let's do the other eye. I'll be speeding this up, you guys won't be able to hear me talk, okay? then now we're going to be using a concealer to cut my crease I normally use this concealer oh my god you guys I'm going to be used looking at the monitor a lot hope you guys can forgive me concealer from Anaz this shade is a uh, medium to ginger I use this also on my on my face and in the same shade I use this same shade on my face but I don't use this concealer much on my face just because I'm lazy and I don't like tubes so I don't like uh, yeah, tubes like this so we're gonna be cutting the crease I'm gonna be looking forward and I'm gonna start in the middle don't know how I can show you guys this you guys can see right right over here This is where I'm going to be cutting the crease. See, I have a, I have a hooded eye, so I don't want my crease to be here. I want my crease to show, even though I want it, the cut crease to show, even though my eyes are open. So I'm going to be putting the cut crease right above my, my crease. So it's right here, and from here, I'm just going to be stamping. So now the cut crease is done, I'm going to be adding a bit uh, of, I want a bit more depth, so I'm just going to be adding this maroon, uh, maroon shade right here called Reckless, taking that with a small brush right on the end here, add some depth. Also be taking a small amount on the tip of my brush coming forward So now I'm going to be adding the red shade right over here where I, put the, where I started the cut crease. We're taking the orange shade that we used called Lit. I'm just going to be blending it in with the red shade. Then for the lid, for the front portion, I want something lighter in color. So maybe we are going to be using, I use this tiny brush over here, this brush is from Real Techniques. I'll be using it to apply, let's go with a, uh, let's go with this gold beautiful shade here, called Keen. 
right under the yellow beautiful shade so I'm gonna it's like a gold it's like a khaki gold like it has it has some green in it so I'm just gonna be packing this on And this brush is so nice because it's, it has this pointed tip which makes you able to like carve out where you want the color to be. I like brushes that are tiny and that you can carve, like I can carve out this cut crease here. I'm going to be putting the glitter right where I put the glitter glue. So, I'm back. I put on some lashes. I put on some, uh, this is the mascara I used. It's from uh, Be Perfect. I put on uh, some eyeliner as well as uh, lashes. These are called Mariana lashes. This is actually yeah, a local brand with very good lashes. So, the, the, sh the name is Arena. I buy them here, amazing. That's about it. So we're gonna just continue with the face and uh, you know lower lash line first I'm gonna take the same brush I use I'm just gonna pick up uh, one of these highlighters from the shade it's called fair play it's actually a highlight but I'm gonna put this on my inner corner right here a bit dusty it's dusty from the from, this is a bit dusty from the thing from the glitter that I've used so don't mind it. I'm just gonna add that on my inner corners. A little bit there. Such as this one. This is from Morphe. The Morphe E36. It's very tiny, so it's very good for lower lash line. I'm going to be adding uh, the yellow color first. Okay. I'm just going to be buffing this on my lower lash line. I hope you guys can see me. My lower lash line. Sister, working. Yes, sister is working. Sister. Yellow color. Then I will be using the same brush. I'm going to. I want it to be a different color, so I'm going to be taking. Um, let's go for brown here. This is called slow burn. It's like a rusty. Yeah, this color right here. It's rusty brown. Very pretty. It's got a little bit of an orange base. Sahim, shh. So I'm just going to be buffing this right along my lash. For my lips today, I want to use this Huda Beauty lipstick in the shade board meeting it's like a very pale pale nude okay just gonna be applying this I hope you guys enjoyed the video please don't forget to subscribe and also ring the bell so that you can get notified of my uh, future videos I'm so happy to have you guys here with me uh, in this journey with me I hope you guys enjoy some of the, all of my videos or some of them do let me know if you like them do let me know if you think there's some changes I need to do because this is anyways that's it don't forget to like share and subscribe please I'd really appreciate it it's re to really help me out so Thank you guys for watching. Bye. See you next time. Bye.